David, you've claimed that the UK healthcare system, the NHS, has in many respects actually got worse over the last few decades. Can you give me a sense of the price that the professionals who work within that system are paying for that deterioration? Yes. Well, first of all, let me talk about what's happened, in my view, over the last four decades, say, which is the length of time I was a GP principal. And that is that the technology, without doubt, has got better. But our human engagements, both within the profession, in other words, colleague to colleague, and the care that we give to patients have become worse from a personal point of view. In other words, in terms of our personal understanding of people, our personal knowledge of them, and therefore the personal satisfaction that we get from that as professionals. The evidence for that is quite daunting, really. Um, in the general practice, and psychiatry, I believe, are having great problems with recruitment, with staff sickness, with um, early retirement, earliest retirement, um, with uh, burnout, and most tragic of all, of course, suicide. We have a low morale profession throughout pastoral healthcare non-technical healthcare, the morale is much worse um, through the decades. 